The rocket ship is just launched. Here comes the ultimate warrior. The following contest is a ladder match. That is for the WWE Intercontinental and the WWE Intercontinental Championships. Making his way to the ring from parts unknown. Weighing in at 275 pounds, the Ultimate Warrior! Well, here's the man to be the first person to be crowned a double champion at WrestleMania. Yeah, who could forget that moment at WrestleMania 6 inside the Toronto Sky Dome? It was the Ultimate Challenge where the Ultimate Warrior defeated Hulk Hogan to claim both the Intercontinental and World Championship. I remember it like it was yesterday. The whole world felt the power of the Warrior. And his opponent, accompanied by Jimmy Hart from Memphis. Tennessee weighing in at 247 pounds. The Honky Tonk Man! And, and things breaking down before the match even starts. At a certain point, you have to be ready for something like this. You get caught sleeping, you deal with the consequences. Referee signals for the bell, and we are finally underway. These superstars are seeing red right now, gentlemen. Two-handed choke slam! Kicks directly to the chest. No respect being shown whatsoever with those stomps. Ow! Relentless attacks from the Ultimate Warrior. The Ultimate Warrior is intensity personified. Ladder matches can turn into some real car crashes, but as many of the greats have proven, there's a strategy to them. You have to keep your wits about you, even when you end up on the wrong side of a ladder. And believe me, chances are quite high that you'll end up on the wrong side of a ladder at least once in a match like this. And we might be seeing a competitor crumbling before our very eyes. Turned that one around. And he puts a quick stop to the momentum that was mounting against him. He weathered the storm and wants to create a flurry of his own. And they just busted out an impactful maneuver. Honky Tonk Man is unable to stop any attack. Honky Tonk Man's got to find his spot and take advantage. Caught with a clothesline. Certainly doesn't possess any lack of creativity when it comes to how to use the ladders as a weapon. Being carried around with ease. Oh my gosh! Boom! Head first. A mat slam with some attitude. And that was offense with a powerful purpose. Two-handed choke slam. He is just reeling from that offense. Ultimate Warrior just letting himself run wild. We'll see if he can maintain that unmatched energy. Bobby Dog Man grabs a guitar, ready to play a tune on his opponent's head. Oh, and a knee to the face. Into the ring now. him with the counter. Superhuman power on display from the alt 
Ultimate Warrior. Man, does Warrior have an insane amount of power. And he has free reign to the outside with no count outs to worry about. He'll take things into the ring. Octagon Man dodges out of that. This isn't the smartest thing to do. Antagonizing your opponent instead of attacking him. Electricity is flowing through the Ultimate Warrior. The Little Warriors are providing the fuel now. Warrior, high risk. Taking flight. And he barely evades. Getting back into the ring. Close the to the back of the neck. Warrior's got him. No getting up from that. Oh, oh, right oh. to the ladder. I don't know how stable that. Oh, look out. He hits it from high above. It is a mess of bodies and broken ladder down there. Oh, look at this. Uh-oh. Honky Tonk cuts him off. Hooked up. He steps foot in the ring again. these men for taking it to the next level. This one's becoming too close to call. Yeah, it's hard to predict how this one will end. Going to get that ladder up. Can't really set it up right in the center of the ring. Oh, perfect. Boy. perfect placement. Into the ring again. Unable to stop any attack. And Honky Tonk needs to find that spark. Drop him. Ball. Warrior with a full head of steam. Ultimate splash. He has to capitalize now. Get to a ladder. He's setting up the ladder now. Looks like to me he's got it in the right spot, Michael. Ouch. And just look at the Honky Tonk man's face after that shot. Positioning that ladder for something here. Uh-oh, high-risk move coming up. He is getting rid of the turnbuckle pad. Don't say that too loud, Seth. Seems like it caught continued attacks coming from the Ultimate Warrior. And nothing can stop the Ultimate Warrior. Lives to fight another day. Heading back to the ring. But he's still got to climb the ladder. That's the only way this match ends. 
Here's the setup. What's going on with the ladder here, Corey? I have no idea. Do they need a map? Byron looks like that ladder is perfectly placed. Now you can't ask for a much better spot than that. And he goes into the ring. Climb. Go for it. Climb. Scaling the ladder now. And he's closing in on the victory here. Reach out your hand and seize your destiny. Questionable timing of this move, Cole. Dangerous territory up there, guys. I think. Reaching out. Looking to get the win. Come on. You got to move quicker than this. For once, I agree with you. Got it. New champion. Ladies and gentlemen, here is your WWE Intercontinental and WWE Intercontinental Champion, The Ultimate Warrior! Truly a huge win for this superstar, or should I say, for the new champion. Honestly, Michael, there is no 